Hello and a warm welcome to everyone across the globe. We should be on the way very shortly. The players will be with us any time now. And here we have Sporting Lisbon against PSV. This is Peter Drury and next to me providing insights will be Jim Beglin. Well, thanks, Peter. There's a great sense of anticipation in this stadium. I've been hit by it too. Sporting Lisbon have chosen to go 4-4-2. 4-4-2 is as orthodox as it comes, Peter. It's been tried and tested through the ages, and it'll continue reappearing through the ages. Carvalho. Oh, well defended. That had to be done. And it's Carvalho. He's got away with one there. That's what all good teams do these days. Pressing from the front is highly effective. Well, the first attempt hasn't quite drawn first blood, but they've got a slight edge. Looks like a good ball through. Nicely controlled. Massive leap! A oh, great save, real class. The keeper really dug out his defence then, a magnificent effort. Lisbon, very much in free-scoring form of late, goals in each of their last five games. Well positioned to make that interception. Luke de Jong. Timely intervention. Chip through. Saved only by poor finishing. Oh, no, that was a chance. What a chance. Look, they may have nothing to show for it so far, but this is one determined start. Dumbia passes it through. Well read, he sorted that out. Goalkeeper's ball. Arias. Van Ginkel. Going through. Shapes the shoots. Same again, same outcome. They're just lacking a cutting edge, Peter, and while that's fairly obvious, the rest of their attacking play is actually quite good. Dumbia boots it to safety. is wayward. Well, Peter, he clearly felt he was being invited to shoot, and it wasn't the worst decision he could have made. Looks 
to slip it through. A really good feat from him. Time to deliver. What a throw in. So what's he planning here? And it's Dumbia. Dumbia! Yeah, that's top defending in preventing him turning, which can open up many possibilities. Whistle's gone, that's a uh, foul. It in gently. Drill hits it. Well, he should have done better, and he knows it. Yeah, he may have snatched at that a bit, even though it was quite close. Strength too strong for his opponent. Oh, good interception. Tries a through ball. What an adventurous run from a defender. Should have hit the net. to match well as contact goes that was tremendous and it helped him to direct it exactly where he wanted into that net I think when it comes to the area of the park this fella is definitely no sledge PSV get themselves into the lead. Still a fragile lead, though. They can't afford to sit on this. Tries a through ball. Goes for the cross. Up for a header! He's done well to get his head on that, but couldn't score. Well, plenty of moving targets to pick out in the box. Obviously increases your chances of the ball being met like that by someone. Van Ginkel. Long and high towards the flank. And it's been intercepted, and that will come to nothing. And out to safety. It's gone out for a throw-in. He's got away. And he's there to cut it out. Dumbia. Dost. 
And now they can launch a counter. It's another to add to football's endless list of could-haves and should-haves. Look, the game is full of ifs and buts. If only the, the pass could have completed its journey. Mattia. Piccini. It's a good run down the right. Where could this lead? Well played, he saw that coming. Sporting Lisbon. Need of a lift as we head up towards the break. Arias. Is it out wide now? It was all about the quality of the delivery, and they come away with nothing. De Jong plays it out to the wing. Has a swing at it! Forward it goes. Fender's on the back foot. Dost tries to stroke it through. De Jong floats one over. Rui Patricio cuts it field. He's made certain that won't get through. And it's Luke De Jong. Out to the left it goes. The ball's come loose and the chase is on. Van Ginkel moves it backwards. De Jong has a go! And that's been lever clear. Lobs it in gently. You can get that clear. And there is the half time whistle. And there we are. Off they go for half time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half, but there has only been that one goal. It is very, very tight. Not the most convincing of displays. They can certainly do much better than this. They'll want to keep things simple, build up their confidence, and not rush into mistakes. Here we go again. Sporting need to get the balance right to sort this out. Ambition must be complemented by just the right amount of caution, and I think the more experienced players can oversee that. Through. Chance! Luke de Jong over to the left. So who's he picking out? Knocks one in. Header! Decent attempt, but not quite good enough. Oh, look, I don't want to sound too dismissive, but from here, that looks the harder thing to do. They've come out of the dressing room firing on all cylinders now. We could be in for quite a second half here. Dumbia. Well won, that's good play. Keeper's got good distance on that. And it's Dumbia. Looks like a good ball. Header! Went with his head, but couldn't steer it in. Do I really need to tell you, Peter, that he has to do better, especially from there? William Carvalho did well to step in there. That was more than necessary. Arias. Just brushed off the ball there. Promising move that good inroads into enemy territory, but no joy. Luke 
De Jong out wide to the right. The ball needed to be better there, that's a wasted chance. Well, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. Brennett clearly is miffed having made the run and not get picked out. Dicks one in, cuts it out. And it's Dumbia. Short of a shot's on! Good stop, that wasn't easy. Well, you can't ask for much more than that. A difficult moment he simply had to deal with. Save, he got a decent fist on that. Can he put it away? Looking for support. And the finish! He's done very well to get to that. Well, what can I say? Truly wonderful goalkeeping. to hurl everything at it and hope for a break. Spot on, Peter. Goes long. Knocks it away. And it's Luke de Jong. De Jong pushes it out wide. Played out to the wing out for a goal kick. Tries a through ball. Hits one! Big relief, it just needed better contact. Oh, I'm not sure what he had in mind, and I don't think he knew either. De Jong, PSV couldn't do a whole lot with it there. They could do with more sharpness in their passing. forward great strength too strong for his opponent and it's Dumbia it's Dumbia oh and they really should have been made to pay by the keeper, he's just given it straight back. Dumbia clips one through, going for goal! And that's been levered clear. That intervention was very necessary. Dashing forward at pace. De Jong 
Plays it out to the flank. He's got options out wide. He's left it. He's had a go! Oh, and that should have been two. He got too ahead of himself there, thinking how he could have made things safe. It so nearly came off for him. Well, Peter, I think it's fairly obvious he's one of the biggest influencers out there. There is some activity down on the touchline. It seems there's going to be a change. I think you have to admire his willingness to keep plugging away, but the manager has, has done him a big favour, I think, by, by taking him off. You know, he was looking very, very leggy. Pass. This is good ball retention, and it should be enough from here, but they want to double their advantage. Get the better of his opposite number. Freddy Montero sprints it wide. Now here's the through ball. Keep calm and carry on. That's the job in a nutshell now. Montero battles to win it back. Peter, they have to fight the onset of desperation and keep enough cool heads to still deliver. Sporting Lisbon must do something here and very quickly. They need something heroic now or a lucky break or a kind refereeing decision. Anything. Now it's Luke de Jong. Now the pass. There's a real appetite from them to finally put this game to bed, but will they? Challenge, he just stood firm. And it's Carvalho, aim long and direct, boots it to safety. Quinn Chow looks to dink one in. Well, it remains to be seen whether they can come up with that little bit of class to rescue this situation, and it needs to be any time now, really. That is a poor kick by the keeper, being intercepted. Luke de Jong. Played out to the right. Helps available out wide. Up to meet it! And he's there to make a great save. Well, that was high-class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high-class weight. Oh, he really wanted that. But that's the motivation and enthusiasm he shows and the quality he produces. But with time running out, they have to get the ball in the penalty box. And if it means a long punt, then so be it. They've got to give themselves a chance. A poorly directed kick from the keeper. He's given it away. Lobs it in gently. Lovely little display of skill, that is. Knocks it away. Tries and a header! Another chance! Certain amount of room for debate here, but a goal kick's been given. Kick by the keeper, he's just given it straight back. This is promising. Out to the flank. Fired in. And that is that. It has ended in disappointment. Defeat and back to the drawing board. Well, the way the manager has stormed down the tunnel lends itself to an almighty telling off for such a, a timid, docile display. That's where we have to end it. From me, Peter Drury, and my co-commentator, Jim Beglin, a very good evening to you all.
So hello and a warm welcome to all of you worldwide. We're just waiting for the central characters to make their appearance and then we will be underway. I'm Peter Drury and this is Jim Beglin. A delight to have him on board. Cheers, Peter. It's a privilege to be here. It really is. Young boys have chosen to go 4 4 2. Well, it's a setup that places greater emphasis on the supply route coming from out wide. particular here. Theo Walcott warrants a mention. He's shown a, an extra facet to his game by playing through the middle and while he is certainly... Uh, can he put it away? He's done very well to get to that. Well what can I say? Truly wonderful goalkeeping. Plays it forward. Battles to win it back. Deftly done. Nice little flick. Goalkeeper's ball. Schneiderlin. it out to the wing gorgeous control there lobs it in gently I think that's offside yes it is yeah that's a good spot and a good call gets it upfield good challenge he just stood firm Walcott. Out towards the flank. Up to meet it! He will be livid with himself. Good ball through. Now the cross. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. Walcott with the ball through. Walcott coaxed out to the wing. Promising cross. Sigurdsson. Sigurdsson hits it! In for the follow-up! Well, they won't be deterred from trying again, Peter. They have the bit between their teeth now. Funes Mori with the challenge, and he has given away a free kick. Baines tries to get it forward quickly. Coleman. 
Schneiderlin. 0 0 still. I like their chances though. Well, they could have had a bit more joy earlier if they'd varied their game and, and played a longer ball forward. I think this is looking much more promising now. And it's Suleimani. Baines. Coleman. Walcott. Dispatched. There was no reaching that. Well, I think two keepers would have had a hard time keeping that one out, never mind one. There was real venom in the strike and, and clear composure from the placement. He is now just one behind the competition's top scorer. Young boys get themselves into the lead. Yeah, and they know there's plenty of work left in this one, Peter, before they can actually say that the job is over. And play for a throw. And it's Suleimani. Suleimani dicks one in. It's gone out for a throw in. Here's the cross. Timely intervention, aimed long and direct. Just brushed off the ball there. And it's Suleimani. Young boys, desperately need someone to hold up the ball here. Whipped in. Towering header! They've scored! Hot knife through butter! They have done it again! However they tried to stand in his way, he just was not to be denied. Oh, this fella's as slippery as a kneel the way he freed himself to score. I mean, for that defence, it was a case of, now you've got him, now you don't. Brilliant. boys have a couple of goals without reply it's 2-0 well at 1-0 this contest was still nicely poised but now that it's gone to two mindsets are affected a lot more winning belief one way and that losing feeling the other it into the channel and the 
assistant referee has his flag raised for offside. Well, he now knows that he has to lock in the timing. Success and failure depends on it. Let down by a lack of accuracy. Forward it goes. Played out to the wing. Now here's the through ball. Sigurdsson. Pushes it out wide. Looks to slip it through. Up he gets! Good stop. That wasn't easy. Well, that was high-class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high-class wage. Tries to stroke it through. Schneiderlin. That's a throw. Go down too well with his teammates. Long and high towards the flank. And that's a goal kick. Schneiderlin passes it through. A buccaneering run from the defender. Gets it back. And the shot! Right towards the front man. That's great defending to cover for the goalkeeper and just get something in the way. And a header! Oh, he did the hard part right, but fluffed the finish. It was such a clever idea. Can he score? That's a cracking strike, and it may have stung the palms of the keeper. And it's half-time here. What have we learned from the first 45 minutes? Young boys just didn't want the half-time whistle to be blown. Convincing and controlled. Young boys sitting pretty here at half-time. 2-0 up. <laughs> and that's the start of another 45 minutes. Ashley Williams, Lassi, chip through, Baines has it out wide and in space, great class son, and he's there to make a great save, the keeper really dug out his defence then, a magnificent effort. Safety. Brings it forward. Soleimani. What an adventurous run from a defender. Schneiderlin. Palassi. He's lifting it over. And it's 
Soleimani. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Funes Mori. David Klaas. Walcott. Plays it out to the flank. Great run on the overlap here. Coleman battling down that right flank. Oh, that is lovely footwork. Hits one! Good movement there, but not the best of finishes. Well, being able to generate that amount of activity in the box means it's hard not to pick someone out. Soleimani. Sigurdsson tries to get it forward quickly. Schneiderlin. And it's Polassi. Sigurdsson. Balassi looking for a decent ball in. It's being played forward. Gets into a dangerous position. I think the substitutions will be coming up pretty soon. Back. Looking to break out here. Good challenge. Stood up well against his man. Sigurdsson. Balassi. It's a good run down the right. Where could this lead? Coleman. Oh, he's had a shot! A oh, great save, real class. Well, as Tesco, Peter, the keeper has just received an A plus grade. Some activity down on the touchline. It seems there's going to be a change. Good save, he got a decent fist on that. And out to safety. And it's Klaassen. Walcott. Klaassen. Wolf loose, who's getting there? Coleman, now the pass. Walcott delivered. Hits it! No, he couldn't get the direction he needed. Young boys can defend those situations better by stopping the crosser at source. Funes Mori plays it forward. but the less said about that pass, the better. Closing in on the last quarter of an hour. And it's Baines. Schneiderlin looks to dig one in. Velassi. More than happy to take the muscular approach. And going for goal! And oh! World class from Walcott! And it 
has to be said, an absolute gift. a game here well they've given themselves a chance here but now it's a case of getting the balance right between attack and defense and that's not easy Soleimani tries a through ball and a shot there's a real appetite from them to finally put this game to bed but will they Schneiderlin, Davy Klassen. Did really well to intervene and dispel the growing danger. We sit high. Pops it into the area. And he's cut it out. Keep calm and carry on. That's the job in a nutshell now. And it's Suleimani. Keeps everyone guessing. Tries to stroke it through. This is good ball retention, and it should be enough from here, but they want to double their advantage. Both sides then taking this chance to turn to their benches. Well, his stamina was called into question then, but there's absolutely nothing wrong with his heart and, and the effort he put in. He was very willing, though, not quite able. Suleimani. Out to the left it goes. He's got options out wide. He's gone for it! Oh, the keeper's done ever so well. Well, you can't ask for much more than that. A difficult moment he simply had to deal with. Oh, he really wanted that. Well, Peter, I think it's fairly obvious he's one of the biggest influences out there. Yeah, it's safe to say that they just need to manage this to secure the win now. Well, they're looking at the referee, but he's waved play on. It's Soleimani. Williams hurtles into the tackle. Young boys certainly don't need to overcommit now. Their priority lies further back. Suleimani. Young boys just have to run down the clock. Chooses to... And Suleimani! <laughs> so, the manager making the last of his changes. There is the final whistle. Young boys come out on top. Hard fought, impossible to predict. In the end, though, only the result mattered. So, Jim, how do you reflect on what we've seen? Young boys were totally organised, disciplined and professional here throughout. They knew exactly what they were doing and duly assured. And with that, it's time for me to thank Jim Beglin and to wish you a very good evening.
So a warm welcome to you all, we will be on the way very shortly once all the pleasantries are complete. I'm Peter Drury and this is Jim Beglin. Thanks for that Peter and may I say a big hello to everyone. Juventus are in a 5-3-2 formation. Yeah, that back five can allow the central man to become more or less a sweeper and both fullbacks to become much more ambitious. So it's away we go then. Kadira. Pjanic. They'll try as they might, they just couldn't get into an attacking area. Just brushed off the ball there. Dybala. Licksteiner. Who's he going to play in? Dybala looking to get on the end of this. A brilliant interception. Small off. Tries a through ball. Pumps it into the area. Rukani. Licksteiner, Pjanic, lobs it in gently, Dybala, Pjanic, Pjanic! He's done very well to get to that. Well, as Tesco, Peter, the keeper has just received an A-plus grade. Juventus certainly won't want to look back and, and dwell on that. It was a good chance, though. Played out to the wing, Iguain to get on the end of this and it's hoisted clear Iguain it is a corner header he will be livid with himself look they may have nothing to show for it so far but this is one determined start Juventus, very much the team that started on the front foot. I know it's still early, but they're showing the better signs. No caution from them. Shoots! Oh, the keeper's done ever so well. Well, that was high-class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high-class wage. 
Lichtsteiner. Tries to get it forward quickly. No chance to the score. Nil nil it remains. And the weighted pass. Marquisio. Pjanic. Chiellini. Deftly done. And he's made sure that that won't get through. Passes it through. Pjanic. Lichtsteiner with a searching ball. Smolov looks to slip it through. And that's been leave it clear. Aimed long and direct. Queen. Oh, sweet feet. We set high. Has a swing at it. Oh, great save. Real class. Well, what can I say? Truly wonderful goalkeeper. it out of harm's way. Barzali goes up and over. Glued to his feet. Great leap! <laughs> Alexandro. Long and high towards the flank. were asked, but he's given the answers. Marquisio. Kadira. Pjanic. And it's Dybala. Out to the left it goes. Oh, it's a searing run. He is a man on a mission. Oh, he's gone out of play. Pjanic. Pjanic, and Pjanic! Forward it goes. Looks like a good ball through. And he just whacks it away. And that's been one straight back. Dybala with a long pass. Iguain looking to get on the end of this. A really good feat from him. Going through. He's got options in the box if he gets his head up. And it's Dybala. Looking to shoot. Tries to get it forward quickly. It's an entertaining game, this. Both teams have had chances, but it is still nil-nil. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Oh, the defence got the better of him this time, but I'm sure he'll go again. Pjanic. Alexandro. Spreads it wide. 
Higuain to get on the end of this. And that's been lever clear. Pjanic! Good stop, that wasn't easy. Well, you can't ask for much more than that. A difficult moment he simply had to deal with. It so nearly came off for him. But that's the motivation and enthusiasm he shows and the quality he produces. Dinks one in. He's in, surely! Dybala. He's left his man. Nick Steiner. Aimed long and direct. Iquain. Beautifully done. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Breaks on here, chip through. Looking to... The shot's on! Great ball to play him in, but he will be gutted to miss that. And the half-time whistle goes. So both sides have drawn blanks. They have toiled at times, but it's not been a bad game by any means. See a views on the first half. Well, we've seen a lot of willing accompanied by a fair amount of waste so they've both got to tidy up their scoring act had a grossing half but we're still where we started nil nil that gets things going for the second half juventus playing well with lots of opportunities and plenty positives to take from the first half despite this scoreline converting chances would make a world and the finish and he's there to make a great save. The keeper really dug out his defence then. A magnificent effort. Alexandro goes looking. Now the pass. Iquain. Forward it goes. And now they can launch a counter. Marquisio. Chiellini, Rucani, passes it through, done very well to intervene. Smolov, Pjanic gets it back, Marquisio, Chiellini passes it forward. Oh, no, that's not the ball he wanted. it into the channel steered out wide but he won't reach that one this is promising he's shot a goal he's done very well to get to that well you can't ask for much more than that a difficult moment he simply had to deal with Battles to win it back. And it's Alexandro. Now it's Tipala. He's gone for it! It's being played forward. Dashing forward at pace. Deftly done. Tipala. Dybala, Pjanic, and if you did take an extended half-time break, you'll be relieved to hear that you have missed nothing. Great ball, and now the shoots! No mistake! 
Uh, deflection may or may not have made a difference. Little matter, it is his. Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. Look, experienced voices need to be heard now, along with good purpose and urgency, and they can get right back into this. I have to say, that was an exemplary tackle. Stopped him dead in his tracks. Steiner tries to get it forward quickly. Rukani. Lick Steiner. And the weighted pass. Well read, he sorted that out. That's what has to be done now, no question about it. The hit and hope is just about the sum of it, isn't it, Jim? Just has to be done. Looks to bypass the midfield. Back to the keeper and try something new. Gets it upfield. So, Jim, what are you thinking? Well, there'll be no accusations of uh, a lack of effort. They're giving as good as they get when it comes to chances. Dybala, and it's Higuain, Higuain pushes it out wide, goes wide, Nick Steiner, whipped it, hurls himself at it, what about it, Juventus are level, spectacular header, he really flung himself at that, you know, it takes a lot of courage to do that, to throw yourself at the ball knowing you can catch a boot in the head. Well done, son. And that has added a whole new complexion to the game. It's pulsating, it's absorbing, and it's hugely entertaining. Every single player is giving everything. He's got away. Tries a through ball. Played out to the right. Reeled, tries one! Pjanic really got caught in a trap there, and he just couldn't get out. Smolov, great strength, too strong for his opponent. Out wide to the right, gets it back. Aimed long and direct, now a chance to break. Plays it out to the wing. Crosses into the area. And it's hoisted clear. Stroke it through, and he's cut it out. 
concentration levels are very good, and so is the commitment. This game could yet yield a winner. Actibola! Goal at his mercy, and somehow he's missed it. Paolo Dybala fully appreciates that he could have won it then, and now he'll be all the keener not to lose it. Checks on the touchline, a change about to occur. Well, with the introduction of such a tall lad now, we may well see uh, a more predictable lofty route forward, but it's still very hard to deal with that, you know, if they if they can affect it right. Here comes another... Oh, diving header! Brave effort, total commitment. A good attempt. The ball was at a, a lovely height too. And now the breakaway. Juventus have it back and they can go again. Juventus showing a good level of intensity at this stage. They're calling on all their resources now. There is some activity down on the touchline. It seems there's going to be a change. Well, for me, this was the obvious substitution. He'd become just a little jaded, and as a result of that, he was most likely to make a mistake. I think sometimes when the body becomes tired, the brain goes with it, and I think that's happened in this case. Tries lifting it over. Look, this can still go either way. It might be flowing one way, but there's still time for some ebb. Stroke it through. Good challenge. You've had just to stood firm. full marks for their attitude and application in trying to win this. It means an awful lot, obviously. Smolov. Chiellini puts it to safety. Concentration levels are very good, and so is the commitment. This game could yet yield a winner. And there goes the final whistle. Well, no winner here, but an intriguing game. The result probably a fair reflection. It has finished all square. Your final thoughts, Jim? Yeah, this looked the most likely outcome, but we've had a, a good variety in this game, despite it being anticlimactic. So just time for me to say thanks to Jim for his wisdom and to wish you all a very good evening.
the warmest of welcomes to you. We await the conclusion of the pre-game formalities. My name's Peter Drury, and here's my co-commentator for the game, it's Jim Beglin. Thanks for that, Peter, and may I say a big hello to everyone. Athletic Bilbao shape up in a 4-5-1. Yeah, essentially this system lends itself to a more cautious approach, but that's not to say they can't turn caution into steady ambition. the whistle Valenciaga Mikel San Jose and the counter is on spreads it wide Blasukovsky San Jose plays it forward Athletic Bilbao really have been poor at home lately. Five games here without a win. Muniain floats one over. Done very well to intervene. Looks like a good ball through. He's got options out wide. And that has been clubbed away. That's a foul. Simple decision for the referee. Bruma. And back to base. Keeper's got good distance on that. Turaspe battles to win it back. Keeper goes long. Now a chance to break. Blasukovsky looks to thread it through. He's gone for it! Goal! First blood drawn. Well, you know, thinking about that, I think they've perfected that on the training ground because it took them seconds to get the ball from back to front and they really commit forward in numbers too. That was all very well drilled. Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. And that ought to be the trigger for a really exciting and entertaining game from here on. Valenciaga. He's having a look round. Plays a clever pass. Tries to dink it in. Camacho. Athletic Bilbao suffering an early setback and looking to reel it back in. Well, it can be very hard to regroup and work your way back into the match, but they've got time. Passes it through. The Marcos plays it into the channel, and the flag has stayed down. Good clearance now, can they make something of it?
He's left his man. Time to deliver. Shoots! Ashikovsky. Bruma. Bruma. Balls out on the left now. Aduris. Aduris. Out to the flank. Muni Ayin. I think that's a corner. Yes, it is. Clearance and very necessary. Back to the keeper and go again. Inaki Williams. Raquel San Jose. Aimed long and direct. Looks to slip it through. It's a brilliant interception. That was one quality pass away from being a very decent chance. Looked very promising. Athletic Bilbao just had to make the ball stick, but came up short. Camacho. Bruma. Camacho. Demarcus. Forward it goes. Long and high towards the flank. Now here's the through ball. Valenciaga. Tries a through ball. Rudy Ayin. More than happy to take the muscular approach. Oh, that's a foul in a dangerous area. Well, that looks like a final warning. Still no card. has certainly made things interesting. Well, look, Peter, who knows what's about to happen from here? Uh, I doubt this will be the final score, though. Played out to the wing. Blaszczykowski looking to get on the end of this. A slightly better ball would have led to a very different outcome there. Uh, that was just poor decision-making and a weak execution. Now the pass. He's got options in the box if he gets his head up. Knocks it away. And it's Blaszczykowski. Passes it through. Now it's Blaszczykowski. And it's hoisted clear.
Looks like a good ball through. And the ball is out of play. Tries a through ball. Played into the middle. And shoots! And the follow-up. Goal! Athletic Bilbao! They've done it! It was coming! They have their reward! He was so alert to the possibilities there. Great stuff. Oh, Peter, you can't teach that. You either have it or you don't. His anticipation is on another level to everyone else's. Superb. Athletic Bilbao get themselves into the lead. Yeah, they deserve great credit for turning things around, but they'll now need the defensive resilience to equal that attack and flair. Out wide to the right. And helps available out wide. Can't get the better of his opposite number. Yeah. Timely intervention. It's a raspy to get it forward quickly and it's been intercepted and that will come to nothing athletic bilbao with a quick fire double to complete the comeback aimed long and direct oh good interception Long and high towards the flank. And that's been lever clear. Good idea, just poorly executed. It's a raspy. Valenciaga. Rudy Ayin. Inaki Williams. Valenciaga. First 45 minutes are up. Athletic Bilbao come roaring back in quite some style. We've got a very different game now. The midway point of the game. Well, Peter, I'm just thinking of the best way to describe that. Frantic, um, frenzied. It was unmissable and it was irresistible. Forget about the analysis on this one, just enjoy it. Athletic Bilbao head into the half-time break with a narrow advantage. It is 2-1. We're promptly into the second 45 minutes. Changes made by neither side, from what we understand. Passes it through. Now here's the through ball. Adjuris looks to get on the end of this. That always looked inevitable. The defence dealt with that really well. De Marcos. Now it's Adjuris. It's a Raspe with a long pass out wide. Aimed in towards the centre. Bruma. Camacho. Plays it out to the flank. Blaszczykowski is desperately calling for it out wide. Muni Ayin. Gets it upfield. Oh, that had to be more accurate. Pings it out wide. It's a loose ball. Naki Williams. 
to Raspe. Muniain. To Raspe. To the keeper and try something new. Well positioned to make that interception. That's a throw. run down the left-hand side it's come loose tries to stroke it through up he gets no he didn't quite meet it right I think he deserves credit for for getting something away given that he had to contend with a, a double dose of closing down Valenciaga San Jose his goal scoring skills have already been evident played out to the wing Camacho. You would think the first substitutions would be coming up pretty soon. Now the pass. Who's ball? Who's going to get that? Tries to get it forward quickly. It's Oraspe, long and high towards the flank. Oh, that's neat. Oh, the ball's come loose and the chase is on. He gets it back. Bruma. Looks to slip it through. Checks on the touchline, a change about to occur. <laughs> well, it's good stuff. This is better. Well, this isn't the time to talk about risks now, Jim, is it? They just have to hurl everything at it and hope for a break. Just has to be done. Now can he finish? Can he deliver? Gets wrestled off the ball. Camacho. Blaszczykowski tries making a foray down the right. Looks like a good ball through. Ball's loose, and he's after it. Matthew Reese. Now the pass. Going through. Deep cross. Dicks one in, and he's cut it out. No fluke, it's what he was there for. Oh, look, there's only one player who merits all the praise for that. Not only did he finish it, but his instincts for being where he was absolutely top notch. His second of the game, and an eye now for the hat trick. <laughs> Athletic Bilbao, two up and into a position of real strength.
spreads it wide. Referee's given a throw. And more than happy to take the muscular approach. It's a raspy, forward pass. Inaki Williams. It's a raspy. To Marcos. Played out to the wing. Now here's the through ball. Plays it out to the wing, coaxed out to the wing. Plays it back, turns and goes back. Chooses to go back, forward it goes. Muniain clips one through. Delightful ball. And the finish! Oh, and he's got good distance, who's chasing? Adjuris with a beautifully timed run. And it's Camacho. Tries a through ball. He's gone for it! Goes for goal! In it goes! With so little time left! Grandstand finish! He was really quick to react to the initial save, and he has his reward. Well, that's not the best attempt by the keeper, and he's just paid the ultimate price, hasn't he? Sides then taking this chance to turn to their benches. This is threatening to become a really good game. It's just a question of running down the clock now. Tries to dink it in. He's got away. Raul Garcia passes it through. Now here's the through ball. Another chance from a corner. And that will be the final act. Well, that's bounce back ability, responding superbly to come from behind, shrugging off setbacks along the way, and determinedly getting there in the end. Your reflections then, Jim. Look, a win's a win. Sometimes it's not as you'd like, but you have to find a way to produce what you need. And I thought they did that. And that's where we have to end it. From me, Peter Drury, and my co-commentator, Jim Beglin, a very good evening to you all.